So what is up guys I'm Andrew Jared back with another video and today in this video I'm gonna be showing you how to make a cool clean YouTube channel profile pic so without wasting any time let's get straight into the video so first of all you have to open pixel lab and just add your name whatever name you want I will be adding geoid it's Andrew Jared is a very big name so now just transform it and make it more bigger like this way and just click on the check mark after that just click on the second option and click on the font and now just click on the my font and under the font name will be in the description it is a paid font but I will be giving the link to download it for free after that just click on this ok and what you have to do is just add a dot over here so it will look nice so as you can see this and now just click on the plus and just click on the text and add another text click on the edit and just input M and click on the done and now just click on the font again and you have to choose another font this font link will be also given in the description you can download it it is a font based on have heart and now just resize it click on the TT and that means size and just make it like make it more closer and now just click on the fourth option and click on the transfer and now just save to the save as image and save to the gallery and you have to choose format as a png and now just open photoshop touch and you have to click on the plus and click on the back blank document and create it of thousand thousand and here we go click on the thousand thousand and after that just click on the end and click on the grid and just input your gradient whatever gradient you want and after that just click on the empty layer and just click square selection tool and just do like this and now just select the empty layer and just click on the end and then click on the fill and stroke and just click on the stroke after that just click on the stroke up to it looks nice for you after that just click on the edit and click on the select pixel and just click on the end and click on the gradient so it will look like this and you can choose any other gradient you want over there it is looking nice so click on the check mark and after that just add your drop shadow and after that again drop shadow to all the four sides like this so now it's completed we have added our drop shadow successfully and now just click on the photo library and just input text that we made from the pixel lab just resize it after that just click on the check mark now, just click on the fx and click on the drop shadow add some drop shadow to it until it looks 3d so add two times the drop shadow so it will look like this after that it's about to complete now just click on the, the second option and click on the shadow and just highlight it like this as nothing works but it looks nice just click on the last gradient image and just click on the second option and click on the curves and just choose whatever curves you want until it looks nice for you I'll be choosing this curve for my, me and click on the check mark so guys if you like this video please give it a like and subscribe for more videos and check out my channel there are lots of endless stuff available hope you will like and subscribe too thank you for watching and stay tuned Tell me that you love me, even if it's